As the Democratic Republic of Congo prepares to vote a new president in less than two days, presidential candidates, notably President Felix Tshisekedi and Maurice Katumbi, have held their final political rallies. Incumbent President Felix Tshisekedi held his final political rally on Sunday ahead of Wednesday's elections in a bid to retain his position as leader of the Central African nation. Like all other candidates, the president made similar promises of creating more jobs and infrastructure and also putting an end to the 28 years conflict in the East that has led to the death of almost 6 million people. Over in Lumbubashi, the second largest city in the Democratic Republic of Congo, business tycoon and former provincial governor Moise Katumbi held his final campaign rally on Monday where thousands of supporters gathered to listen to his passionate and hopeful speech. Despite tensions and obstacles, Moise Katumbi's rally in Lumbubashi remains a highlight of the electoral campaign in the Democratic Republic of Congo. It embodies the hope for a better future for the country and the desire for the population to see real changes. Some 44 million registered voters will cast ballots in presidential, parliamentary, provincial and local elections on December 20th in the vast Central African nation of about 100 million people. President Felix Tshisekedi is seeking another term after winning disputed elections in 2018. The country is one of the poorest in the world, with little quality infrastructure, and the Seni Electoral Commission is still struggling to distribute voting materials to more than 175,000 polling stations.